Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Tech, and in today's video what we have is we have a brand new update for our Samsung Galaxy smartphones that gives us some new features on the gallery application. So in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly what's new. What I have right over here is the older version of the gallery, and what I have here is the latest version of the gallery. So I'm gonna show you exactly what has been updated. Now, first and foremost, if you do wanna get the latest update, you wanna click the link down below that is gonna take you to my website. Once you're at the website, you wanna scroll down. Under download, you wanna click link number two. Ignore link number one. You need link number two. When you click this, it will take you to the store. And once you're there, you wanna click to get the latest update. And again, if you look right over here under what's new, we have a brand new full screen scrolling option and a couple other things I'm gonna talk about. So let me demonstrate exactly what's happening. All right, so I'm gonna launch my gallery application right here, okay? So that's just the old gallery, just a couple of days ago, that's what we had. Now we have this new version. Now when I go to the new version, what you are gonna see when you go into your settings is you are in fact gonna see a brand new option that says full screen scrolling. Now on the old version, you're not gonna see that under viewing options, all you see is auto play motion photo. So that's what's new, okay? Now let me show you exactly what that is. So let's go back over here. I'm just gonna go into this album right here. Okay, so we have a bunch of photos here. Now look at what happens here when I don't have the full screen scrolling enabled. As I scroll up and down, nothing happens with the status bar and the bottom bar over here, the buttons bar, they both remain in place. So if I go up and down, okay, this area moves, but these and these are still available. Now with the new version, with the full screen scrolling, when I go up and down, notice how the status bar and the button bar or whatever you have down there is gonna disappear. So you are gonna get that full screen look as you're scrolling up and down especially when you're going down, it just disappears. Now with this one, watch, all this stuff right here and here does not go anywhere, okay? So that's the full screen scrolling option in the gallery. And again, if you wanna grab it, just click that link to update to the latest version, unless you already have it. Now let's go back over here and see what else is new. So I'm gonna just tap over here, go to Galaxy Store. Now, additionally, we have, it supports drawer UI on tablet devices or in DEX mode. So if you have a tablet, maybe a Tab S7, S6, or if you use the DEX mode, you are gonna get the drawer UI option. And additionally, uh, if you have photos that are in the cloud, now what they did was they added a tip card. A tip card basically is a little tutorial card that gives you relevant information. So if I were to go here, for example, let me just click edit so you can see what I'm talking about. Hopefully it appears uh, right here. So you can see that this photo is a cloud photo because on the top we have this option that says this has been saved to the cloud. So I can actually download this photo from my cloud as opposed to, it's not a local copy, it's a cloud copy. So with now with that new tip card, uh, every time you try to download a photo from the uh, Samsung cloud contents, it's gonna give you a little tip, okay? Just give you a little information as to what's happening. That's all there is to it, nothing huge. I was not able to replicate that in that in this uh, portion because I don't have any cloud photos on this phone, but I have it here, but this happens to be the older version of the gallery. So not a big deal. Uh, the biggest thing is in fact, the full screen scrolling, okay? So if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day, all right? All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.